All right, Shalom. First and foremost, I want to begin this lesson by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash. Also, I want to give double honors unto the apostles and elders of Great Millstone and peace and blessings to the hopeful elect, the 144,000 men that are laboring this work for the sake of Yahweh, Bahashem, Al Shai. And also, I want to say Shalom to the rest of the elect, which consists of the men, women, and children that are part of the great multitude. That I listen to these videos and that serving the Lord to the best of their ability, I want to say Shalom. All right, so I'm coming back with another daily edification, daily exhortation through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashem Al Shai. And I pray that this lesson is edifying to the hopeful elect. All right, so I'm going to start at Sirach chapter 9, verse 11. It reads, Envy not the glory of a sinner, for thou knowest not what shall be his end. Okay, so it says, Envy not envy not the glory of a sinner all right because um because the wicked all right the sinners on this side okay you know they uh you know they got the riches all right they got nice cars they got the houses you know they got the women okay but we're not supposed to envy the glory of a sinner okay because we know that the end of of uh the end the end of these sinners Okay, the end of, of, of these people that's prospering in, in this world, all right, ultimately they're going to be destroyed. All right, because Yahweh Shmuel Shai, on this side, he's dealing with the meek and the lowly. You know, he's not. But in this world, okay, Job 9 and 24 tells us that the earth is given into the hand of the wicked. All right, so the wicked, they're prospering in this world. All right, you know, they have all the money. You know, they have, they have the cars, they have the clothes, you know, they have... They have everything in this world, okay? But, but, but this is not this is not our kingdom, okay? We're not going to get our glory on this side, okay? And we're fighting for for everlasting glory, okay? Well, because in the kingdom of heaven, all right, Lord willing, we be those men, all right, one hundred and forty four thousand. They're going to be the next kings. They're going to be the next rulers, all right. They're going to be the next celebrities, all right. And the scriptures say, the first shall be last. And the last shall be first. All right. So the people that's first in this society, in the kingdom of heaven, they're gonna be they're gonna be last. All right. Like like Michael Jordan, you know, uh, Kobe Bryant, uh, Floyd Mayweather, Drake, Lil Wayne, Rick Ross, Future. All these guys. Okay. They're 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 in their glory right now. You know. And people follow after them. You know, the people idolize them, okay? But this world is ran in wickedness, all right? And two-thirds of our people, they're following wickedness. You know, they, they, they sell out the Esau, you know, to, to, to get glory on this side, okay? But our glory is not going to come on this side. You know, our glory is going to come in the kingdom of heaven, all right? When, and starting with, with, with the Awashai, you know? But this is not our kingdom, Okay, and we're not supposed to be envying the sinners on this side because we know the, what's the end of them. All right, so I'm um, Sirach nine to twelve. Delight not in the in the thing that the ungodly have pleasure in. Right, you know the, it says delight not in the thing that that the ungodly have pleasure in. You know, uh, drinking, you know, partying, you know, giving in to marriage. You know they they uh promote drugs, you know, promote uh, sleeping with another man's wife, you know, committing adultery, you know, because this world is ruled in wickedness, all right, and everything that these uh, sinners do, all right, is, is, is adverse to, to, to the ways of Yahweh Bashem al -Shai. this world is, av is adverse to the ways of Yahweh Bashem al -Shai, all right, and scripture says, uh, roughly paraphrasing, if you let me just get it, Salakia. Salakia. All right, this is First John chapter 2 and 15. Love not the world, neither the things that are in the world. If any man love the world, the love of the Father is not in him. All right, so we ain't supposed to love the things in this world. You know, we ain't supposed to be envying what the wicked be doing. All right. It said delight not in the thing that the ungodly have pleasure in, you know, celebrating, celebrating New Year's, celebrating your birthday, you know, celebrating Christmas, you know, just being in that in that in that state with this world, man. All right. 
And it says, I'm going to read it again. Sirach 9 and 12. Delight not in the thing that the ungodly have pleasure in. You know what they have pleasure in? Money. You know, um, selling out the Esau. You know, trying to have a status in this in this world. You know, trying to be rich. You know, that's, that's what the ungodly delight in. All right. And it says, but remember... They shall not go unpunished unto their grave. All right. So hey, the entities, the entities, sinners are going to be are going to be judgment. All right. It's going to be death. All right. So these the the the, the sinners that's in this in, in, that's prospering in this world, you know, that they, they they got the glory in this world. Y'all about Shmuel Shai said that they're not going to go unpunished. All right. And that's the end of these people. All right. The, the scripture say they shall know they shall know me by death by pain. Roughly paraphrasing. All right, so these sinners are going to have to get put to death. All right, he said, All the scriptures, Amos 9 and 11, I believe, all my people shall die by the sword. All right, and that's what's coming. You know, Yahweh Bashim Al Shah is coming to slay. You know, just Proverbs. And we're going to see a lot of our enemies. All right, we're going to see, uh, we're we seeing these celebrities getting judged right now. You know, this is Proverbs 21. In verse, uh, start at 15. It is joy to the just to do judgment, but destruction shall be to the workers of iniquity. All right, the workers of iniquity. All right, those are the those are the evil doers. All right, those are the sinners. All right, and that's that's their um, that's their that's the, that's the end all be all. All right, they're going to receive destruction. All right, because hey, everybody got to pay for their wickedness. All right. And that's why it's important to repent, you know, because we was all sinners. All right. We was all workers of iniquity. You know, we, we, we was in this world. We was following other gods. All right. But 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 we repented. All right. Through the spirit and power of Yahweh Shemal Shah, we repented. You know, we, we changed our ways. You know, we stopped. We stopped following, calling on false gods. All right. We stopped smoking blunt. You know, we stopped smoking black miles and cigarettes. All right. And we returned back unto Yahweh Shemal Shah. All right, this is Proverbs 21 and 16. The man that wandered out of the way of of understanding, all right? This this is that understanding. You know, this wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, you know, following following the land whithersoever he go. All right, those the people that that, that fell out this truth, you know, they they, they um they 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 took their hand off the plow. All right? They wandered out of the way of of understanding, you know? These people that walk past the camp, you know, they they they're wondering now the way of understanding. All right, and this is the judgment shall remain in the congregation of the dead. Right, man. All right, the congregation of the dead in this world, you know, and because because these people in this world are, are dead. All right, these people in this world is dead. All right, they walking, they literally walking zombies. You know, they 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 breathe, they eat, but they don't have the spirit. All right, and the spirit, that's that's what makes you alive. All right, and to prove that, this is John 6, verse 63. It is the spirit that quickeneth. All right, that word quickeneth goes back to made alive. All right, so it's the spirit that makes us alive. You know, right now, the, we, we, we had a spirit. You know, we have life. All right, we follow the law, touch the commandments. All right, we, we, we stop calling on false gods. All right, we stop uh, being workers of iniquity. You know, we stop having sex with, with other men's wives. You know, we stop dying our hair. All right, we stop celebrating these pagan holidays. All right, and we start following Yahweh Shai. That's 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 life, man. All right, and it says the flesh profits nothing. Right, this flesh profits nothing. All right, this flesh just wants to keep consuming. All right, this flesh is never satisfied. All right. And it says, the words that I speak unto you, they are spirit and they are life. Right. And 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 and, and we see and, and we it says, it said the words that I speak unto you, they are spirit and they are life. You know, these scriptures, man, these scriptures are spirit and they are life. You know, and that's and that's what's washing us. All right. The scriptures say you are washed by the word, you know, and that's how that's how we've been washed, man. That's how we've been. We, that's how we've been clean, you know, through this word. You know, reading, all right, studying, you know, making our call in an election sure. All right, these things, uh, it's, it's life, man. All right, being in this world, you know, following the ways of this world, 
worshiping other gods. You know, these two thirds are, 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 are dead, man. All right. You know, all these celebrities, you know, these entertainers, they, they, they're dead. All right. You know, they might have gold. They might have these diamonds, you know, but spiritually they're dead. All right. And. Yeah, another scripture. This is Proverbs chapter 11 and verse and verse. Let's just start at four. Proverbs 11 and four. Riches profit not in the day of wrath. All right. Your riches ain't going to profit you. All right. You know, these celebrities, you know, they're selling out. They got these. They got all this money, you know. Hey, the, your, your, your riches not going to profit you. All right. Your silver, your gold. All right. You're not going to be able to, to buy your way into the kingdom. You know, and that's why you got to store up your treasures in heaven. All right. With neither moss nor rough, no, neither moss nor rust corrupt. All right. You know, you got to you got to build up your treasures in heaven. All right. You know, because these two, these people is carnal, man. All right. They, 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 they only, they only, they only see what's carnal. You know, what's in a bank account, they 401k. All right. But none of that stuff is going to be able to deliver you. You know, so all the all the all the people that's striving to be uh, rich, you know, you striving to, to, to get a place, and I mean, you striving you striving to get uh, status in this world, man. All right, that's not gonna be able to save you. You know, the Lord ain't don't care if you got a doc, doctor's degree, a master's degree, bachelor's degree. You know, the Lord don't care if you got straight A's. You know, he don't care how rich you are. None of that stuff means nothing. The the wisdom of this world is foolishness. With, with, with the most high. All right. And it says, but righteousness delivers from death, man. All right. Uh, righteousness, you know, because the scriptures say uh, our work is not is not done in vain. You know, the Lord is not unrighteous to forget our work and labor of love. All right. Which 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 we are showing towards the Lord. All right. You know. So our righteousness, that's what's going to deliver us, you know? So that's why you got to be storing them in your treasures in heavens, all right? Making your calling and election sure. Doing this work, all right? Because this is the true money, all right? This is the true riches, all right? And this is Proverbs 11 and 5. The righteousness of the perfect shall direct his way, but the wicked shall fall by his own wickedness. Right, man? All right? Because your sins, script say your sins going to be your accusers in that day, all right? You know, because the rages of sin is death, man. All right, and uh, a lot of our people, you know, they're uh, they're 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 um, they 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 their their sins is is reached the heavens, man. The scriptures say talk about the the sins has reached the heavens, man. All right, so there's a point in time, you know, where where the Lord, you know, he he said, if you do, you know, there's a point in time where the Lord, you know, he gets fed up. All right, the Lord is only gonna take so much from 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 from, from two-thirds of our people man all right like kobe bryant you know he his day that he was going to die you know the lord knew it all right but anyways let me go to proverbs 11 and 6 the righteousness of the upright shall deliver him right man our righteousness all right and what's righteous all right ecclesiastes 12 and 3 i mean 12 and 13 you know the whole duty of man you know keep follow the law and commandments you know the Lord says, if you love me, feed my sheep, you know? So this is what's righteous, all right? Seek, seek, seek you to, seeking the Lord, man, all right? Following his ways, all right? Because these these ways, uh, following after Yahweh by Shemel Shai, keeping his laws, you know, having faith in, in his word, you know, that's what's going to deliver you, all right? And it says, but transgressors shall be taken in their own naughtiness, all right? So the transgressors, man, they, they gonna they gonna die from their own sins, man. All right, the Lord is 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 allowing these is allowing these th th this wickedness to go on. All right, because because there's gonna be a day where where, where these people are gonna get judged for their wickedness. You know, the 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 wicked. You know, they're 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 not gonna go un un unpunished. All right, everybody's gonna have to pay for their sins that they have committed. All right, except the elect. 
All right, the Yahweh Shah, he died on that cross for the sins of Israel and first and foremost the sins of of the of the elect, man. All right, we are we we are covered through through the blood of Yahweh Shah. All right. You know, but Lord willing, this lesson was edifying, and I'm gonna close out by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash. Also, I want to give double honors unto the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, and peace and blessings to the hopeful elect, the 144,000 men that are laboring this work for the sake of Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. And also, I want to say Shalom to the rest of the elect, which consists of the men, women, and children that are part of the great multitude that are listening to these videos and that serving the Lord to the best of their ability. I want to say Shalom at the water, Yahweh Bashim Shai, for putting the spirit on me to make this lesson. Lord willing, to the next lesson, I'm going to say Shalom and a Baba Baba. Shalom.